Hey everybody, this is Teddy from Alohi, and in this video I'll explain to you how to port in your existing fax number to Fax Plus. Fax number porting is completely free of charge and it allows you to enjoy all the features of a cutting-edge online fax service without going through the hassle of changing or losing your fax number. If you wish to keep your existing fax number and port it to a Fax Plus account, please follow these two steps. Before requesting porting, make sure that your current provider supports porting, that your fax number is active, and that there is no unpaid balance. And when this is confirmed, you can go ahead and fill out the porting request form, which you can find on our website at www.fax.plus, or by clicking the link down in the description. This form is pretty straightforward, you'll only need to fill out your email address, your name, your current fax number to port, the country where your number is from, and the service provider. Once we receive this form, our customer support team will check to see if your number is portable and will get back to you within one business day. If your number is portable and depending on the country you wish to port your number from, we will ask you to upgrade to a specific plan. For example, if you're porting a US fax number, you will need to upgrade to a premium, business or enterprise account. You will then need to choose a temporary, random fax number. Once you have upgraded your plan, you will need to fill out the Fax Plus Porting Initiation form, which you can find on our website or by clicking the link down in the description. In this form, we will ask you to fill out a letter of authorization, which we also call LOA, and send it back to us along with the most recent copy of your invoice from your current provider, to serve as a proof that you own the number. Note that the information on the LOA must match the authorized username and service address provided by your current career, so please fill out the LOA according to this guide. Once we've received the LOA, we will immediately start the porting process, which can take between 2-4 to four weeks depending on how fast your current career responds to the request for transfer. Once the porting process is done, we will assign the ported fax number to your fax plus account and remove the temporary fax number, unless you wish to keep both, which you can simply do by upgrading your plan to business or enterprise. If you want to port your Google Voice number to Fax Plus, you will need to first unlock your number by visiting the Google Voice Unlock page, selecting the number to port, and paying $3 to unlock it. You will then need to proceed to step 1 and 2 of this video. If you want to port your eFax or RingCentral Fax number to Fax Plus, you will need to acquire a paid plan on Fax Plus and follow step 1 and 2 of this video. And after providing us with a document required within the form, such as the LOA and billing statement, we will start the porting process. Well, there you have it. After completing these simple steps, you'll be able to use your current number as an inbound and outbound fax number, all the while benefiting from the best and most secure online fax service. Thank you very much for watching this video. Click the subscribe button and the bell icon down under and give us a thumbs up if it was helpful. Have a great day. Bye now.